Welcome to Whatcom Community College Massage Program Information Session. My name is Theron Irish. I'm the Whatcom Community College Massage Program Coordinator. I look forward to working with some of you this fall. We have a really dynamic program here at Whatcom Community College. We get our students involved in community events. We get you access to industry leaders. And we have one of the highest success rates in the nation in terms of passing your national exam. Welcome Community College Massage Program is a nationally recognized, innovative and collaborative program with a warm, welcoming environment, inclusive of diverse changing communities. Students receive current skills and education allowing them to be the top tier of their profession. The involvement of and collaboration with healthcare professionals allows for organic professional development, mentorship, internship, and job opportunities. One of the things about our program is that we really try and get our students out there in the community working on the public. We bring in healthcare providers from the local community to share their skills, make sure students are getting the most up-to-date skill sets uh, and access to potential job leads. Welcome to College Massage Program offers students a little bit more. We had this fantastic opportunity to go to a cadaver lab at Best Year and the amount of information we were able to get. It's incredible. We partner in the community to get out and actually practice on the community as part of their learning. It was awesome to kind of get a little bit more hands-on experience. Being able to work on different types of bodies really gives us a whole education. We currently have a one-year certificate program, uh, but your career as a massage therapist can look a lot of different ways. Uh, you can work in spas, you can work in chiropractic offices, multidisciplinary clinics. We're seeing a lot more multidisciplinary clinics opening up in terms of massage therapists, working with chiropractors, acupuncturists, um, physical therapists. Uh, you can work in treatment work, you can get on a cruise ship if you want to travel, see places. If you want to work with athletes, there's sports teams you can work with. Uh, there's energy work you can do. It's also a great trade uh, if you want to pursue future education. A lot of our graduates go on to become acupuncturists, naturopaths, but it's also just a great high paying trade uh, if you want to work in the healthcare profession to make some good money. Massage schools are offering a lot more options these days. You're seeing a lot of online and hybrid style classes. Uh, being a community college, we're able to um, offer those hybrid classes and online classes a little bit uh, more streamlined because we have a lot more resources uh, here. You're also seeing study abroad programs at some other schools, it's uh, really popular. Um, there's a lot of student clinics uh, and graduate student clinics that gives students more opportunity to work on the public, get more experience. Um, there's internships, job boards. Uh, our program offers an internship program that's integrated into one of your classes in the springtime. Um, The facility and staff here tailor the experience towards each student. I have four kids and I was nervous getting out here and doing something for myself that there's help around every corner and they come in and they ask you if you need help. I was so excited to finish this program and get my license. I think it's going to open a lot of doors for me. The average therapist starting out in Whatcom County earns about $31 an hour. Um, now there's a lot of things that factor into that. Uh, some places offer benefits. So if you're working at a place that maybe offers a little lower wage, like uh, $27, $28 an hour, but they're offering medical and dental uh, benefits, then that, that factors into your wage as well. So kind of keep that in mind when you're looking for a job. Um, but most places in, in Bellingham, Whatcom County, 
uh, pay between about uh, 25 to 35 dollars an hour uh, starting out if you're working for yourself uh, the average therapist charges about 72 dollars an hour We really try and give students an overall view of what's out there and what's available for them. We have highly sought after guest lecturers that teach up to date treatment modalities. People in the community that are in this field, we have this connection with them through our instructors who know them. With our local connections, we really try and work with students to help them find employment. Besides Massage Envy, there's other franchises and there's chiropractors and there's spas. Everybody right now is looking for massage therapists. So our program is considered a one-year certificate program. Uh, it starts in the fall and it ends in the spring. So it's three quarters of massage classes, which is about 45 credits. But we also ask that you get an additional 15 credits of general education. Uh, that can be like a communications class, an English class, a business class. Uh, we usually recommend that you get those done before you enter the program. Uh, that way, once you graduate uh, with the massage core part of the program you can get licensed and be off and running um, but we do offer those uh, 15 credits year-round or in the summer uh, they're offered uh, in hybrid format as well as online uh, you can apply uh, your massage course credits towards an AA in liberal studies uh, unfortunately this is not a transfer degree uh, but you can use 15 credits of your massage classes as electives towards any AA transfer degree if you want so that one of the benefits of being at a community college is we have a little bit um, different accreditation. We have regional accreditation as well. So the classes you take will stay with you uh, and transfer to other community colleges in terms of your general education credits. So we're seeing massage as being a lot more medically valid these days. Um, more doctors are referring out to massage therapists for medical treatment. Um, more massage therapists are starting their own businesses and working with other massage therapists. Uh, you're seeing multidisciplinary clinics with uh, therapists working with athletic trainers, acupuncturists, physical therapists, uh, naturopaths, chiropractors, really providing a more collaborative uh, approach to healthcare, uh, I think, which is great. So how you can apply to our program, uh, basically you go to Wacom.edu and you apply to the school. Uh, it's free to do. Everybody gets in to Wacom. And then you can go to our massage page, Wacom.edu slash massage, download an application and uh, submit that. Our application consists of uh, three experience forms. So we want you to really explore the profession a little bit to make sure this is really something you want to do. Uh, so we want you to get out and talk with other massage therapists, maybe job shadow, get a few massages, uh, that sort of thing. Uh, we ask that you get some professional references, uh, background check, uh, fill out an essay. So this application will take you a little bit of time. So if you're looking to apply, uh, we are on a first come first serve basis. So the sooner you get your application in, the uh, more consideration you'll get. Uh, you can contact me uh, or Anthony Statangelo. He is our academic advisor for the massage program. We're happy to talk with you about the program at any time, uh, see if it's a good fit for you. We have students come visit um, when we can, or potential students come visit us. The cost of our program uh, is pretty comparable to most private schools. Uh, our tuition is uh, 45 credits at $220 an hour. $220 a credit, excuse me, which is a little under $10,000. Uh, you'll need to get some linens and some textbooks. But one of the great things about being at Whatcom Community College is uh, our resources. You know, we have a lot of funding resources you, you should look into. Take a look at this um, PowerPoint picture here, write some of this stuff down and really look into what kind of funding options you have. 
Uh, we have opportunity grants. We have worker force retraining um, programs. We have basic food and education training. We have veterans programs. We have uh, financial aid. So uh, really look into this as a way of getting your education funded. There's a lot out there and we're happy to work with you. So again, uh, we look forward to working with some of you in the fall. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us at any time. My contact information is right here. You can reach me at 360-383-3726 or my email, T-E-I-R-I-S-H at whatcom.edu.